The United States has intensified its efforts to persuade Saudi Arabia to distance itself from China and other BRICS nations due to concerns over geopolitical and economic issues. Washington's primary objective is to curb the transfer of sensitive technologies, infrastructure, and data to China, which it views as a potential threat to U.S. national security and economic interests. Despite this pressure, Saudi Arabia's recent actions, particularly its signing of $50 billion worth of agreements with Chinese financial institutions, indicate a clear shift towards closer ties with Beijing. These developments align with Saudi Arabia's broader strategy to diversify its economic relationships and reduce its dependence on oil as part of the Vision 2030 initiative. The new agreements with Chinese banks aim to foster two-way capital flows, supporting both debt and equity investments, thereby deepening the economic integration between the two nations. One of the most notable aspects of this relationship is the increased Saudi investment in China. The Public Investment Fund inked six major deals worth $50 billion with top Chinese financial institutions aimed at enhancing bilateral capital flows and supporting investments in sectors such as technology and infrastructure. This follows a surge in Gulf investments in China, which jumped from $100 million to $2.3 billion in 2023, underscoring the rapid deepening of economic ties. Saudi Aramco has also expanded its foothold in China. In 2024, the energy giant secured two major deals, reinforcing its role as a key crude supplier. One such deal was a $3.6 billion acquisition of a 10% stake in Rongsheng Petrochemical Company Limited, ensuring a long-term supply of 480,000 barrels per day to Zhejiang Petrochemical Corp., one of China's largest refining complexes. Additionally, Aramco, in collaboration with North Huajin Chemical and Panjin Xincheng Industrial Group, announced a $12.2 billion project to construct a refinery and petrochemical complex in Liaoning Province, expected to be operational by 2026. This facility will include a 300,000 barrels per day oil refinery and substantial petrochemical production capacity. Despite U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken's assurances that Washington is not pressuring Riyadh to choose between the U.S. and China, Saudi Arabia's actions suggest a deliberate pivot towards deepening its economic engagement with China. This reflects a pragmatic approach to international relations, as Saudi Arabia seeks to capitalize on opportunities without being tethered to traditional alliances. Before delving into the topic of Saudi Arabia and China trading in their local currencies instead of the U.S. dollar, let's take a quick pause. Could you do us a favor? If you enjoy our content, please hit the like button. To help even more, Leave your thoughts and feedback in the comments. Your engagement helps us grow. Thank you. The trade relationship between Saudi Arabia and China has grown significantly in recent years, surpassing Saudi Arabia's trade with the United States. In 2022, the total trade volume between China and Saudi Arabia reached approximately $116 billion, marking a 33.1% year-on-year increase. China has become Saudi Arabia's largest trading partner with much of the trade focusing on oil, infrastructure, and technology, as well as newer areas such as green energy and communication technology. China's imports from Saudi Arabia, particularly in oil, play a key role in this trade relationship, with Saudi oil exports to China alone valued at $55.5 billion in 2022. In contrast, U.S.-Saudi trade was substantially smaller. In 2022, the total trade volume between Saudi Arabia and the U.S. was approximately $46.6 billion. U.S. exports to Saudi Arabia amounted to $21.6 billion, while imports from Saudi Arabia were around $24.9 billion, showing a clear trade deficit for the U.S. Moreover, the growth in U.S.-Saudi trade has been slower compared to China's rapid expansion in economic engagement with the kingdom. While the U.S. maintains a significant role in defense and service-related exports to Saudi Arabia, China's broadening influence, particularly through investments tied to its Belt and Road Initiative and Saudi Vision 2030, has resulted in deeper economic integration. Trade between China and Saudi Arabia reached new heights in 2023, marking their growing economic interdependence. In the first quarter alone, Bilateral trade reached approximately $24.3 billion, with Saudi exports to China, primarily crude oil, totaling $13.7 billion. Chinese exports to Saudi Arabia, primarily electronics, amounted to $10.7 billion. By the end of 2023, 
China's total imports from Saudi Arabia hit an impressive $64.36 billion. This trend continued into 2024, with China's exports to Saudi Arabia increasing by 11.8% by May, while Saudi imports from China rose by 3.51%. The steady growth reflects the robustness of the economic relationship, driven by collaboration in sectors such as technology, logistics, and manufacturing. Looking ahead, Saudi Arabia is set to increase its crude oil exports to China in 2024 to meet rising demand from new and expanding refineries, further solidifying its role as a critical supplier to the world's largest energy consumer. China and Saudi Arabia have also advanced efforts to reduce their reliance on the U.S. dollar in international trade. In a significant move, the two nations signed a currency swap agreement worth approximately $7 billion. This deal allows them to conduct transactions in their local currencies, the Chinese yuan and the Saudi rial, bypassing the need for U.S. dollars. The agreement, set to last three years with an option for extension, enables the exchange of up to 50 billion yuan or 26 billion rials directly. This initiative forms part of a broader de-dollarization strategy which seeks to diminish the U.S. dollar's dominance in global trade. As China pushes for the internationalization of the yuan, this agreement marks a pivotal step, especially given Saudi Arabia's standing as the world's largest oil exporter and China's role as the largest energy consumer. The move also enhances financial cooperation and reflects a shared interest in diversifying beyond U.S. dollar-based transactions. This currency swap is a key component of the expanding financial relationship between the two nations, which has seen rapid growth in recent years. It is expected to bolster Saudi Arabia's Vision 2030, which aims to reduce its dependence on oil by developing new industries such as technology and tourism. China-Saudi relations, though limited historically, were formalized in 1990, marking a significant shift in Saudi foreign policy. By the early 2000s, trade between the two nations had expanded rapidly. In 2004, bilateral trade amounted to $3 billion, surging to $25.4 billion by 2008, reflecting the rapid growth in their economic ties. China's increasing energy needs throughout the 2010s solidified the relationship. By 2015, China had become Saudi Arabia's largest trading partner. In 2021, Trade volume reached $87.3 billion, with Saudi exports playing a crucial role in meeting China's growing demand for crude oil. Saudi Arabia has also become a key participant in China's Belt and Road Initiative, leading to significant Chinese investments in Saudi infrastructure, logistics, and manufacturing sectors. The Red Sea Industrial Aluminium Company's $10 billion investment in Saudi Arabia is a prime example of this burgeoning economic partnership. Political ties between China and Saudi Arabia have been marked by high-level diplomatic engagements. A landmark moment came during Chinese President Xi Jinping's 2022 visit to Saudi Arabia, which resulted in the signing of 35 agreements worth $50 billion. These deals spanned critical sectors such as energy, technology, and infrastructure. China's diplomatic influence in the Middle East has also grown, exemplified by its role in brokering the rapprochement between Saudi Arabia and Iran in 2023. This mediation underscored China's emerging role as a key player in the region's geopolitics, traditionally dominated by Western powers. On June 9, 2024, the long-standing petrodollar agreement between the U.S. and Saudi Arabia came to an official end. Established in 1974, this arrangement had required Saudi Arabia to sell its oil exclusively in U.S. dollars and invest its oil revenues in U.S. Treasury bonds in exchange for military and economic support from the U.S. The termination of this deal allows Saudi Arabia to sell oil in various currencies, including the yuan, euro, and digital currencies like Bitcoin. This shift could weaken the U.S. dollar's dominance in global trade as more transactions move away from the dollar. For the U.S., this could lead to inflation, higher interest rates, and volatility in bond markets. Saudi Arabia's involvement with BRICS and other international organizations highlights its growing focus on diversifying both its economic and geopolitical alliances, signaling a potential reshaping of global power dynamics. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching this video. We sincerely appreciate you joining us today. If our content resonated with you or sparked inspiration, 
please consider expressing your support by liking it and subscribing to stay connected with our community. Your support holds immense value for us. You can watch another video of our channel which is now on the screen.